back in the live center here. You get a vantage point from above this fire. Our 23 ABC's Faven K has been on the ground all day today. She joins us now from a neighborhood which has been hard hit Faven and continues to burn tonight. Lots of people in that area concerned. Tim, that's right. We've been here since about 430 this morning. We're now looking at what firefighters will be facing throughout the evening. These embers that are burning along the hillside. Now, luckily, these homes in this neighborhood that have been evacuated have so far are safe, but firefighters are now working. As you can see above, we see different spot fires burning above. They tell me their main concern is putting those fires out so they do not burn any more homes in this neighborhood. Now, you guys are looking at video from throughout the day. Several homes burned down to the ground right in front of our eyes, not destroying complete neighborhoods, instead burning one home, skipping the next, burning another, then skipping maybe two or three. A lot of folks did stay behind. They say that they were hoping to keep their homes safe. You'd see them with water hoses in hand. We have firefighters from dozens of agencies throughout the state jumping in, trying to save what homes that they can, stopping embers from flying and starting more fires. But when you walk through this neighborhood, I, these neighborhoods, it's jaw dropping to see just how many homes have been reduced to char and rubble. Now we've been hearing people all day say that it feels like a war zone out here. That's a great way to describe it. You know, there's sirens, smoke, embers, flying, ashes falling from the sky. You've really got to give it to these emergency personnel that are putting their lives at risk to save and protect these homes and lives. The good news is that we are seeing the winds calm down, but they're tricky. They'll calm down for a moment and then pick back up, and that is what's scary. That is what can send any one of these embers embers flying onto the roofs of these homes, potentially destroying them. We're, of course, going to continue to bring you guys the very latest developments here in uh, Ventura at the Thomas Fire throughout our show and on our website, turn to 23.com live in Ventura on Faven K 23 ABC.